Facebook and Scipio audience. We are coming to you a little bit remote and from the office. I uh, wanted to wish you a happy holiday week. And whether you're watching this this week, which is the 4th of July, or any week where there is a holiday, the things that we have to tell you today can really help your business. We're talking 10x, 50x, 80x your sales. <laughs> not joking. And this is not, it's not a pushy. This is relevant, personalized content that we're going to talk about today. And we are going to tell you about some businesses that through uh, the use of Scipio, they truly did uh, kill their holiday weekend and post sales as well. So with that, uh, I just want to start with um, one example that isn't necessarily a sales example, but how a company reached out with a personal touch on a holiday. We have this feature called Ringless Voicemail, and if you don't know about it, you need to know about it. We've got several videos in our video library about Ringless Voicemail. It truly is like a voicemail drop, and it's a way for you to personally reach out to customers with your voice, and nothing says happy holidays than a wish from the president or the sales rep that has the account, account executive, nothing means more than hearing that voice on that holiday. Now, oftentimes people don't necessarily go to their voicemail first, so you can send up a follow-up text. It's very personalized. Hey, whatever their first name is, just left you a voicemail, wanted to wish you a happy holidays. Now, that text and voicemail in and of itself isn't going to get you a killer holiday weekend worth of sales. But what it's going to do is it's going to win you a customer for life. And yep. it's the sale that keeps Keep on giving and giving and giving and giving. So that is the first example I want to uh, teach you about is just utilize that ringless voicemail. There are very, 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 and I could 10x very <laughs> few companies that have the texting or SMS capability and offer ringless voicemail. We are one of the very, very few. So you have it in your essential and your premium account. Use it. Use it this weekend. All right, yeah. Jared, that yeah, actually, the next one. <laughs> yeah, if you don't mind, I'm going to jump in and just show very quickly how easy it is to put a ringless voicemail into a campaign and follow it up with a text, uh, if that's all right. Just to show, because, again, I want you guys to be able to utilize this right away. We want again, you to use it this weekend. You take five minutes to create this, and you're creating something that is extremely valuable. Um, and so when you are in any campaign, um, I'm going to just go ahead and do a new drip campaign. I'm not even going to give it a name just to show how easy it is. Um, to add a voicemail, you just click this button right here. You pick your voicemail. I'm going to add a follow-up message, and I'm going to send this message 22 minutes after the voicemail goes out. Um, so they it's guarantee that it's in their, in their voicemail box, and they'll know what to look for. Yep, happy fourth. Guys, we just created this campaign in 60 seconds. Um, this is a very, very powerful feature, especially when, when you use the voicemail and the text messaging together. Uh, and like Bianca was saying, this is available on all of our paid plans um, from Essential, or I guess not all of our paid plans, on Essentials and Premium, uh, you can utilize this voicemail campaign feature. Yeah, it's such an elite feature that we only put it on our Essential and our Premium, but I promise you we're talking about ROI today. Yep. You will see this just with the retention of your customers alone. Uh, it's such a powerful, powerful feature. And I was going to wait till the very end, but if you want to utilize this now, if you are in uh, our free account or if you're in our $19 account, yes, we do have a $19 uh, a month account and you want to upgrade to get this ringless voicemail feature, you can type in keep in touch in your upgrade account link and you will get 50% off. So there you go, see plans. We're giving you 50% off one month. So if you are ever gonna use this during a month, use it during a holiday month. Yep. I want to see how powerful this very feature is. Uh, with that, we had a gym owner that did the same thing, but he did two texts and one voicemail. He did a text before, then he did a voicemail, and then he did a follow-up text after that. Did you know that only 10% of businesses follow up on holiday sales yes. after the holiday has passed? It's ridiculous. We push out these offers a week or a month before and do reminders and then on the actual holiday. But truly, when you are in uh, enjoying your 4th of July, I don't stop and shop. 
I don't stop and sign up for a gym membership. I'm enjoying the day with my family. So if you're not following up after that holiday, uh, you're missing out on a lot of business and you could be in that 90%, um, 90% or 10, 10, I mean, you could be that exclusive 10% <laughs> that doesn't do it. I'm getting my, my, my math wrong. So, uh, just two simple messages and that ringless voicemail right in the middle to offer that promotion. That particular gym owner on that one weekend made $12,000 in sales with his follow-up text after the holiday. And uh, we're going to talk about a couple more use cases, but every story that we're sharing with you today is actually on our website in, uh, it's called resources. It's different than our resource center, but it's in resources. Uh, go ahead and click there. We have a use case uh, with a dollar amount value that uh, our customers made. So you can see the ROI when you're on the paid, any plan actually, even free, free. It's easy to see the ROI, right? Yep. <laughs> uh, you can see that um, for every single industry, right? In our resource um, guide at, at our, the, the footer of our website. Yeah, so if you go to skipio.com and then click on blog, you'll see all of these. Yes, we've got blog. And then if you go all the way down to the footer, we've even got more that are that use cases right there, resource center. It's a different resource center that's in the app. This one's available to everybody. If you have Scipio or you don't have Scipio. So the stories that we're talking about today, um, we've written out here so you can see exactly how they used the platform. Sorry, I've got a <coughs> something in my throat. <laughs> hey, I will take over while you're yeah, take it over. <laughs> yeah, guys, everything we're talking about is is what we've watched our users do um, over the last four years as we've we've you know provided this tool for them. And one of the great things about Scipio is that it it allows you to stay top of mind with your customers and with your employees. Because uh, Bianca is right, your customers are going to be extremely busy this weekend, this weekend especially, with Friday off for the whole nation, and then Saturday um, being the actual holiday. Um, that's going to turn probably Thursday even into a like a vacation day for most people. Um, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, people are going to be partying this whole weekend. Uh, and so they may not get around to doing their business. That doesn't mean they want to do business. They don't want to do business with you. It just means in that moment, they're not thinking about it. And so, yes, sending them the message is going to be great. But the, the, there is, to quote another one of our customers, there is fortune in the follow-up. Um, and so I've got um, a campaign here, which we're, we're going to come back to. But setting up a simple follow-up. Um, hey, here's a code fireworks, be safe out there that gives you 20% off and then sending a follow up message five days later. That's what you're seeing here at 504 PM. Hey, Bianca, did you have a chance to use that promo code? If not, let me know so I can hook you up. That's letting them know a that you're thinking about them B that you want to make sure that they were able to take advantage of this and C they're likely in a much better place to actually do something about your, your promotion. Um, after the holiday and after things are over uh, because now they'll be able to actually take advantage of it rather than being um being so distracted by parties and by yeah what i so. love is a lot of times after a holiday passes memorial day or fourth of july you think oh i missed it i heard about that great deal i missed it with that campaign going out five days after the holiday you catch them and re uh, remind them of the offer that you had and you provided there a link for them or something you, you would send them that. And uh, I bet more often than not, uh, people will act on it that day than they would have before or during the holiday. Uh, we have some examples in the direct sales industry where they've done that very thing. Today is month end. It is the very end um, of June. And I know people are scrambling. So it's not just for the July we're talking about. Yeah, there's a lot but, going on right now. Yes, there is a lot going on. But if you need, uh, some last minute numbers. <laughs> it's another amazing time to reach out with a promotion and uh, remind them of things that they may have missed in the month. And just that personal reminder. I mean, you think people remember what you've sent them. They don't. And so Jared said that stay top of mind. There is no better way to stay top of mind than with a personalized message that they receive on their phone. And we have Melissa uh, that's in one of our direct sale clients. She does this so very well. Yeah. And uh, anytime she has a party, she sends a message before 
a message a day, uh, like a week before, the day before, and then a follow-up after for people that may have missed it. And her texts watching them come in are so fun. Scipio, I just made $400. Scipio, <laughs> I just made $800. That's like $800 in one campaign. And she does, she pays for her account. She said, you know what? Use what I get out of Scipio, pays for my account, and then 10 times that. And so that's why I use the number 10X. I'm not just throwing that out because it's a marketing term. But I promise you, if you use this platform well and you follow up and you remind your customers and you hit them at the right time, which is end of month or before or after a holiday, you, you will not only have customers for life because you're going to personalize that content and make them feel so incredible, uh, but you will win, win sales. Yeah. And there's something to be said about urgency and creating, creating promotions that have an end date to them. But there's also something to be said about just being a person who, and people forget things sometimes. Like my poor wife, I, she, she loves to do a lot of looking around before she makes a decision. And I can't tell you how many times in the last few months she has had something in her cart, went to look at something else, come back to check out and it's gone. Um, or she's missed a promotion by an hour or a few, you know, a few minutes. And she just feels so bad. She's like, Oh, I totally forgot. Uh, our, our life is busy. We have two rambunctious little boys. And, and so sometimes we just don't get around to it. But if I know for a fact, if someone reached out to her and said, Hey, it's okay. The promotion will make sure it still works for you. She would be a customer for life. Uh, and and so perfect example that we get busy it's not that we don't want to act we forget we get distracted yep. uh, and so just that reminder be in that 10 percent that forgets to follow up after a holiday that doesn't forget to follow up after it doesn't forget yes <laughs> that's why we're together you help <laughs> that doesn't forget that doesn't forget yes yep. uh, uh, there's so, oh, sorry, I was going to say, I'd be remiss if I didn't talk just briefly about, I love the product. I love what Scipio has. And a lot of you don't know that Scipio has this, uh, this feature um, on all of our plans. We have keyword campaigns that you can utilize to advertise your promotions on your social media channels. Uh, and so you create a keyword. Uh, so you have a campaign. I've got my 4th of July promo, my July 4th promo campaign that I've created. Uh, and I've added keywords. 4th is one of the keywords and freedom is one of the keywords. What I'm able to do now is on social media, whether it's Instagram or YouTube or TikTok or wherever, I put my number uh, and this word, hey, text this word to this number uh, to get access to our July 4th promo. Uh, and mine is kind of a fun one that I built. Um, I, I like building these, um, but I'm asking what their favorite thing is about the 4th of July. If it's fireworks, family, or food. Uh, and they reply with one of those things and that then triggers to send them the discount. Uh, and so I built this to run automatically so that when someone texts the word fourth or freedom, they get this first message, then they respond with fireworks, family, or food. They get a unique message to them based on their response with our discount code. So it's a little bit more of an interactive, um, an interactive sale or promotion, but you can link your Scipio campaigns to each other so that it runs automatically in the background based on how um, your customers or your employees are responding. Uh, it's a really super fun, powerful feature, highly recommend it. Um, again, we have these, these keywords on all of our plans, not just our paid plans, um, but if, if you're wanting to, to link some campaigns together, I highly recommend going at least to our essentials plan. So then you have 10 campaigns that you can link uh, and take your customers down through a path of you know, three, four, five, maybe even, maybe even all 10 campaigns. I love that you, you just talked about linking those. The amount of time that will save you by setting up 10 campaigns and linking them to each other, it is uh, well worth the value of that 99. And again, if you want to try, even for the 4th of July, try that. I uh, use code keep in touch in your upgrade center and you, you can go ahead and have that for the 4th. One thing uh, that I wanna also mention, that campaign that Jared just wrote or that, that keyword campaign, I love how engaging it is. Want to talk about one trap before we let you go. And this is so, so, so important. <laughs> when we have an offer or a promotion, the tendency is just to take that offer and push it out to as many people as you can. If you want people to truly engage with you and to take your offer, 
we have a secret sauce to sending messages and Jared used it in that message he just sent you. There are three things you must have in a message to get your audience to engage with you. The first, you need to personalize it. The second, it needs to have the right context. They need to know who it's coming from or who you are, what it's about. Yeah. And the third thing is you must engage. Don't just push out. Ask them something so they will reply. Pretend that you are the one receiving the text and ask yourself, would I reply, would I reply? to this? Would I delete? Would I, heaven forbid, type stop. <laughs> and if you have been here, stop, unsubscribe, rewrite the message. Uh, I hear time and time again, this isn't working. Nobody's replying to my text. Can you please make sure my texts were sent? The texts were sent. We look at the message. Guaranteed, it is a push. And if you want that, there, there are platforms that will send out push notifications about deals and alerts. This is not what we are. We are here to engage and nurture and keep lifelong customers. And so make sure when you are sending out these holiday promotions that they include those three things and mirror the beautiful message that you just saw from Jared. Yeah. Guys, thanks so much. We love having you as part of the Scipio family. Um, looking forward to be here next week. Have a great safe 4th of July and stay safe out there. We'll see you soon. Take care.